morning. My name is Leslie Williams, and today's date is Tuesday, October 2nd, 2012, and I'm getting a late start to my day. Um, and I'm making this video file. It's going to have to be pretty fast, and it's going to be multiple tidbits of information in reference to the particulars concerning what's happening towards me in San Diego, California. And I apologize, I don't look my best. I just woke up, and I got some kind of a rash going on above my eyelids. I don't know if I uh, maybe touched some poison ivy or some other type of plant and uh, that I'm allergic to. But anyways, how I look is not important. The statements that I'm making is what is important. And again, this is going to be a tidbit file, and tidbits are tidbit sections of, of information, whether they be one topic or subject matter, or multiple uh, uh, descriptions in reference to one subject matter, which is pretty much what this uh, video file is going to be. Understand this and be clear. Yesterday from UCSD, I contacted this woman directly from her email contact that was on her webpage that you can find by uh, just typing in her name and, and trust me what you do. You can also type in Remote Neural Monitoring Leslie Williams and discover that I'm actually on her webpage because she's running for Congress. And point two in reference to her top po uh, political priorities is uh, to investigate uh, uh, and ban, legislate, investigate, legislate, and ban, and regulate non-consensual human experimentation by satellites and microwave radiation. And targets of organized gang stalking are always subject to non-consensual human experimentation and radiation experiments. The gang stalking is done to help and aid in the bed and breaking a target down for uh, uh, neural uh, entrainment and um, other aspects of these uh, expeditions. All of my emails are being intercepted and rerouted from SDSU, UCSD Biomedical Library, Galipsy Library, Sarah Mesa, uh, uh, San Diego, Sarah Mesa Public Library, Point Loma Library, uh, that's in San Diego, and uh, I also, I contacted her yesterday, and we're going to see how I don't get no replies from contacting her, or if I do, they'll be faked. Uh, and email interception and fake email replies are methods and tactics of organized gang stalking or organized stalking uh, expeditions. Just Google it, and you'll discover that it is. Um, uh, so... Uh, now, non-consensual human experimentation is not the only thing that is directly connected to these organized stalking expeditions. They're also into all types of criminal aspirations like you would not believe, human trafficking included. And um, so the reason why I'm making this audio video file is to tell you that I'm causing so much problems for them as far as exposing them online because cyber, they know what I'm exposing online because they're cyber surveilling me online, which is a tactic of organized gang stalking. Now... I'm causing them so much exposure that they're going to go after my Social Security. They, they, they're they going after my Social Services benefits right now. I just won a hearing on September 13, 2012 with San Diego County Social Services. And they have not expedited one benefit yet. And they tried to literally, literally, literally check this out. In the hearing, they, they said that I won and that I approved my residency for San Diego. And as a result, I qualify for my application process to go forward. And then she told me to go outside and wait for her to print out these facts. Then she came out with a printed out form stating that as a result of me denying wanting a hearing that all the benefits were going to be denied. I caught it because I decided to read it. And as a result of which she kept trying to distract me from reading it. So as a result of this, uh, uh, they just went ahead and moved forward and decided to stonewall the expedition in reference to the processing of the application that they originally denied, and that's what the, what the hearing was about. I highly doubt they'll even let me upload this video, which they do so many times it's pathetic, okay? When I go over to UCSC Biomedical Library and attempt to upload certain videos, if they don't want what's stated in each particular video uploaded because they don't want it exposed, they prevent me from uploading it, literally. I'll get a little dialogue box at YouTube saying that there's a data read error or whatever. So we're going to see if this video uploads. If they take away my Social Security, it will be a direct concerted effort in order to create the financial destitution, which will cause me to run to the very system they're infested in and can maneuver me further down their pipeline. Yeah, yeah, as a result of, of uh, extreme poverty that's created. Everybody has to eat. I'm talking a little fast because I only got a little bit of uh, video time left in this video, but I'm exposing these crimes and what they're going to do as a result of me exposing these crimes. Yeah, 
And if they do it after I'm making this video and upload it, what does that tell you? That they're directly involved in it. My name is Leslie Williams. Look at the comments feature this this YouTube video. If they take me off of Social Security for using any excuse, okay, or if they appear again at this hiking area, I literally just caught them. I, I, I can't, I, I can't uh, uh, detail everything that I just caught from them doing lately, but I literally just caught the San Diego police setting up four to five separate YouTube accounts claiming to be friends of my family. How did they know I was in San Diego? I never told my family I'm in San Diego. I don't even talk to them. And all my videos, 98% of them are titled Learning Disabled Woman. They're not even titled by name. They tried. They set up YouTube accounts and tried to say that they discovered that I was here in San Diego, and as a result of what I was exposing online, that they were going to contact the San Diego Police Department. And that's what they did. And as a result, they set up San Diego Homeless Rescue Mission to come here. But check this out. The comments that they made on the YouTube videos, that they were, uh, they were uh, putting abusive comments and threatening comments uh, on my YouTube uh, videos. And they had this stupid audacity to send an email to me. Okay? And one of these emails enclosed that they knew my hearing date was Social Services on September 13th. How did they know this? I never told anybody. I don't. I don't know anybody here. Um, so that and there in itself, right there. Anyways, I can't expose everything that just recently happened in reference to this particular uh, incident and what they did. But I'm going to make a thorough video concerning that. But I got undisputable proof that the San Diego Police, UCSD, and the San Diego Homeless Rescue Mission worked in concert to set up these YouTube videos to make it appear that somebody was witnessing my videos, contacted them, and as a result, they discovered my web my hiking area, which is way down here. <laughs> Anyways, uh, stay tuned, and I'm going to eventually direct you to some YouTube videos that are... I already got the, P the uh, printed out comments from these YouTube videos that they set up and then made to my videos and the printed out email stating that we know your appointments on September 13, 2012. There's no way for them to know that unless private information was shared. So they've been caught and they know they've been caught. And I got audio files proving San Diego Homeless Rescue Commission and the San Diego Police that came with them saying that Jude Carroll, which is the YouTube channel, is who directed them to me and my YouTube videos. Then Jude Carroll also made a boo-boo with the same YouTube account and sent me a Gmail stating that she knew when my appointment date was. On September 6th, she sent this YouTube uh, this Gmail email to one of my email accounts that I rarely frequent anymore. Well, I went into it for another matter and discovered it and printed it out. So they've been caught, and they know they've been caught. I'm in San Diego, California. Look in the comments feature of this YouTube video. Thank you.